alternating side lunges. We're gonna set up with our feet nice and wide, making sure that our feet are pretty, pit, 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 pointing straight forward. I'm gonna sit back and down to the side. So really making sure that my hips initiate backwards. I'm in that hinge. And then I start to send them all the way over to the side where my foot is. So I'm stacking heel, knee, and hip. Pressing through all four corners of the foot back to standing squeeze. And then other side, starting with that hinge like I'm sitting back into a bench. And then setting up, my hips are square, my chest is forward, my eyes are up hips, knee, and ankle, pressing it back up, making sure we're using a ton of booty, really gripping through the floor with those toes. We keep the feet where they are because it helps us get a little bit deeper into that range of motion. We don't have to really overthink stepping back out in that side lunge, especially if we're setting these up for the day or just really working on banging out those side lunges. Sometimes we get into a little kerfuffle being like, am I short enough? Am I too long? So this is just a really solid way to make sure that you're hitting that proper alignment every single time.